Hello and good morning. Welcome back to another vlog. It is 5 a.m. Um, bright and early. Well, not really bright. It's actually still dark outside, but definitely early. <laughs> um, Kenzie and I have been doing that video this week where we're doing a sunrise ocean cold plunge every day. So today is day four. Gotta throw on a swimsuit grab the camera equipment and drive over to the beach to watch the sunrise and then swim in the ocean. Let's do it. Oh, also Jaden's coming with us today. We were talking about it with her yesterday when we were working and uh, she said she was down to come one of the days. So she is gonna come today. It'll be super fun. I've got on this cute one piece today from Fabletics who is sponsoring this vlog. So thank you Fabletics. More on them later when I can speak a little more coherently, but how freaking cute is this swimsuit? I love it. We're going swimming. Yeah. Sweat set this morning is also Fabletics. Be free, Jaden. That's more enthusiastic than me. <laughs> yeah, I know. She's got, she's got energy. I love sunrises. And then I got home at like 12:30 last night. Why am I doing this video and you're not? <laughs> gonna have more sky like more clear sky today than we did yesterday the first two days were like gray misty nothingness we'll show you the pics yeah we'll the, show you the pics. it was a different experience but i mean the, it's kind of hard to see on the camera but and it's also not windy it's not cold today yeah it's actually very nice out and then yesterday we got our first hint of an actual sunrise sky and today today we got a little bit of it too it's 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 pretty who's ready to get naked <laughs> So then we just go. Yeah, we just go. We strip and then we <gasps> run. Okay. And then we slowly get ourselves to dunk oh gosh, our heads it's under. Be so cold. I already know. I yeah. already know. Yes. I will not lie to you. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, beach. Until tomorrow. So it is a little after 7.30. I just got out of the shower and I, I'm feeling good right now. Not too sleepy, really energized from the swim and I haven't even had coffee yet. So after I get dressed, I'm gonna make myself a cup and that'll probably just give me even more energy, which hopefully I can keep the energy going through the whole day because yesterday I feel like I hit a mid midday slump, like at 11. I was just so tired and it, it made it hard to focus on work, which today is also a work day for me. I've got some editing to do, some administrative work, a couple meetings, and then filming the Fabletic stuff. So that is the plan for today. I, I also was originally planning on doing a workout this morning 
after this went before work. But last night I was editing a sponsored vlog that's due today at noon and I was planning on finishing it last night, but I didn't, I ran out of time. So I figured this, that would be a good use of this like morning time. So I have a 20 whatever meeting at 10. So I'm thinking editing that vlog from eight to 10 will be more than enough time. And depending on how much I walk at my treadmill desk today, I might feel, you know, satisfied with the movement just from that. Or in the evening I can go to the gym or do a Peloton ride if I'm feeling it. So yeah, that is the plan. Let's get dressed, make some coffee. Ooh, and I gotta feed my caterpillars. All right, coffee. I got the caterpillars all taken care of. Look at them in there. I just love them. <laughs> And Steven and Grace are away. Good morning. Good morning. Ugh. Bella wants some attention too. Hello, Belle. Oh, sweet belly. Sweet belly. All right, I love you guys. Sweet belly. Love you, Mama. Sweet belly. Sweet belly. <laughs> And upstairs we go. And we've got all of my new Fabletics items here from their July collection. And I wanna wear this new sport dress today. It's called the Boost Performance Dress. Cute little crisscross back, built-in bra, built-in shorts underneath. I got it in this blue and also in black. And we'll try everything on later, but I am just so excited about this. I wanna wear it all day. Oh my gosh, this is great. Love the color, love the fit. The built-in shorts underneath even have a little pocket on the side. Such a cute cut. I love the little cutouts on the shoulder and how they connect to the crisscross straps in the back. So cute, just as like an outfit, but also I'm dying to wear this to go play pickleball. It would be so cute. And that's what I love about sport dresses. Like they're functional enough for exercise, but they're also so cute to wear for just every day. Like sport dresses and me, we're like this. <laughs> Oh, yay, I, I asked Steven to clear some space on my computer because there was randomly like a bunch of storage being taken up and I couldn't figure out where. And he solved it. Thank you, Steven. But all right, it is time for me to get to work. Let's do it. Right, checking back in, it is now three o'clock. I am done with my editing, done with my admin work, and done with both of my meetings. So things have been going good and I feel really good, which actually I just finished filming a little update about that for the sunrise swim video. Honestly, I, I kind of low key forgot that I even went and swam in the ocean at 5 a.m. Like in my brain, that feels like a different day. Like that feels so long ago. And I just got into like such a good normal, you know, work groove and doing my editing and working through the to-do list, like it just felt like a, a normal day. I had a normal level of productivity. Who would have guessed I was up before the sun and frolicking in the ocean? And thank goodness, because yeah, the the energy levels yesterday were, it was, it was rough. Um, but now that I have wrapped up all of my desk work, we can head over there and do the Fabletics try on. Okay. So, so if you don't already know about Fabletics, they offer premium quality activewear at an affordable price in standard sizes and plus sizes to make everyone feel confident at the gym and beyond. If you like anything you see here, you can click the link in the description to check out all the cute new styles in their July collection. And with Fabletics, you can either make a one-time purchase where you just click guest at checkout or for the best deals, you can join their VIP membership program where you can either choose to shop the new month's collection or skip it by the fifth of every month. And if you skip it, you won't be charged. If you don't skip, you'll be charged $59.95 on the sixth of the month for a member credit. And the member credits you can either redeem for any two piece outfit or any one item up to $100. So that is how Fabletics works. And um, all VIP members save up to 50% off all day, every day. And when you join as a new VIP, like when you place your first 
first order signing up for the membership that's when you get like the big deal like the best deal so if you want to do that you can sign up from the link in my description to get that special offer or if there's just one thing that you're eyeing you can always do the one-time guest checkout too so that's a little bit about fabletics now let's get into these outfits so i think the way i want to do this is just kind of like rapid fire go through everything right here where i like hold it up say the name and then we'll venture on over to my little try on corner where i'll try everything on see how it fits how it feels give you all my first impressions and you can really get a, a good look at it so first up we have the no bounce high impact sports bra in this really vibrant pink color we're making it an outfit with the matching high-waisted on the go leggings i didn't even really used to like pink i feel like after the color analysis though everything changed for me and I've become like such a pink girly. Okay, next we have the three inch length one shorts. These feel like such a nice breathable athletic material and I love the little emblem at the bottom. And on the top, we've got the on the go medium impact sports bra. And then we've got the one jogger in that same lightweight breathable material as the one short with the Faye high impact sports bra. This one has that cute strappy back. We've got the same boost performance dress that I'm wearing right now but in black. This really cute purple set with the neon contrasting piping. It's the boost high-waisted leggings with the Kessler medium impact sports bra and one of my favorite Fabletics bra cuts, the Oasis twist front with the matching Oasis high-waisted leggings. To the try-on corner! Oh my gosh, okay. We're starting off so so strong with the purple set. I love the look, I love the fit, the color, the pop of neon in the back, so cute. And the emblems on the front, I feel like add such a cute sporty touch. This one's definitely a winner. And then the green Oasis set, this is in the Pure Lux fabric, which is just like so buttery smooth, so soft and comfortable. It's even got the little hidden pocket on the side. The Pure Lux fabric that this is made out of is is one of their most comfortable fabrics. It's my favorite for like low impact exercise or just lounging, athleisure, whereas like the, the first outfit is the power hold fabric, which gives more compression, more support for like high intensity stuff. But yeah, this is a great more comfort, low impact option and just nothing beats the feel of this fabric. Okay, the navy set. I am in love with these joggers. I'm in love with them. I Before I picked up the camera, I just like stood here and like moved around in them for like a solid couple minutes because they're just like perfect. They have a tie waist, perfect amount of room in the legs and the butt. They've got the elastic at the ankles and the material is just awesome. Like it feels breathable and lightweight, but very high quality, very sturdy. You know how sometimes when things are lightweight, they're just like thin and cheap. This is like the opposite of that, like lightweight, but high quality. So especially in the heat, I feel like these are going to be clutch and they just look so so good. Oh, and a little peek at the cute strappy back moment for the sports bra. Very nice as well, but sorry, my love for the pants kind of overshadowed it. And then this is the set with the shorts version of those joggers. These feel great too. It's something about that fabric. I just, I want like everything in that fabric. And I love this color. It's so pretty for summer, especially in the sports bra, the way it contrasts with the sides. And Fabletic sports bras, man, they are just so amazing like they they find that perfect balance of like being super supportive without making me feel like my boobs are suffocating and like that's a very fine balance and fabletics just hits it perfectly even like this one is one of their medium impact cuts and i have the same bra in another color that i wear all the time for like all levels of activity and it gives me plenty of support and that's not even their high impact options oh my gosh the pink the pink and just in time for the new Barbie movie. Wow, this is so fun, so vibrant. It's in the power hold material, so the more high compression and this is one of their high impact sports bras. So if you're looking for an outfit that is gonna keep you feeling supported and locked and loaded through like any movement, 
this is it. And in such a fun color, too. Oh wait, and a moment for the pocket. Gotta give a moment for the pocket. And then last one, this is the Boost Performance dress in black. Such a great dress, oh my gosh. I loved wearing the blue one today. So cute, it felt great. And I love the built-in shorts, the built-in bra. It is a low impact support, which felt comfortable for me with like walking on the treadmill today. But when I wear it for like pickleball, I'll probably wear another bra under so yeah, that's a wrap on the Fabletics try-on. Those are my picks for July. Thanks again to Fabletics for sponsoring and check out all of their products from the link in my description. Now comes the hard part of my try-ons where I have to decide what I actually want to change back into. But also I think I'm gonna do a Peloton ride later tonight. So I'm like, do I just cut to the chase and put on one of the legging sets and just wear that for the rest of the evening? You know what? I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put the purple set back on. I just, I love that one. Ta-da! Okay, it's like 15 minutes until five when I take over for Grace. And my original plan with this time was that after the try-on, I was just gonna take some self-timer picks in one of the Fabletics outfits. But when I was looking at all the outfits, I just had this idea that like, the, the blue set with the shorts would really pop at the beach. And I'm literally going to the beach every morning this week. So why don't I just wear that to the beach one of the mornings before the swim, take a picture there on like an empty beach, sun has just risen. And I feel like with those colors, it'll just make such a pretty photo. So I'm gonna do that. And then I also won't be stressing on time to get the right picture in 15 minutes. <laughs> Gracie was with grandma today, Steven's mom and they made cookies, and she's very excited to show me. Yeah. Are those the cookies? Yeah, To eat? To eat? Ooh. Um, oh, I should eat one? Okay, tell me when to take a bite. 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 Mmm, wow. Those are so good. What'd you put in it? Chicken nuggets. Chicken nuggets? <laughs> I don't think these are chicken nugget cookies, but whatever you put in them, they're very delicious. It's Dada! <laughs> Woo! Just was doing some chores outside, but um, yeah, super good day. Gracie made some cookies today with Grandma. And Gracie, these are pretty good cookies. Thank you, honey. You made a cake? Is that a lemon cake? Grace has been a ball of joy. I swear that kid is getting different every half day by now. Her language is exploding. But anyways, we're having fun. I think we're gonna... Or at least I'm gonna Happy lobby. Happy birthday, Dada! Thank you, honey. I'm gonna lobby for some pool time. Ooh! So Happy we'll see how it turns out. Little evening swim. Yeah. Is it my birthday? Should I sit down? Yeah. Oh, you wanna sing? Happy birthday, Dada, Mama! Happy birthday, Dada, Mama! Oh, I get a piece of cake too. Happy birthday! Thank you. Happy birthday, Dada. So the garden has been really looking good lately, really thriving in all of the sunshine we're finally getting. And it just makes me so happy to be out here and like see everything that we grew and everything here we grew from seed, except for the milkweed in our butterfly garden bed. And actually very exciting development. We are now seeing the wild monarch caterpillars all over this milkweed. Like at any given time, I can come out here and spot at least like a dozen, which is so cool. There's another one I see over here. Look at him, that one's pretty big too. Oh, I didn't even see, look right next to it. There's another one. There's another one all nestled in in the leaf. Slightly smaller one right here and kind of hard to get the camera to focus, but if you can see right there, there's a monarch egg. Still lots of fresh eggs being laid, which means uh, as the days and weeks go on, there's only gonna be more and more caterpillars, eventually more and more butterflies. It's just so freaking cool. And our cosmos are blooming. Grace and I have so much fun coming out here and seeing how many caterpillars we can find. It's just so cool. Hi, sweet pea. You gonna swim? With Dada. With Dada and Mama. Well, I better go put my swimsuit on. Steven just got Grace in her swimsuit while I was doing that. I'm gonna go put mine on and we're gonna do a little family evening swim. So much for just putting this outfit on so that I can wear it right into my workout tonight. But, but we'll set it aside. I'm coming back for it later. <laughs> 
We have had the best time in the pool. We're just about to get out. Steven's taking Grace to get changed. And man, she has just like totally become a water bug from her swim lessons. She's so comfortable in the water. She's doing submersions with us now. She'll do her back float. She'll blow bubbles. She started swim lessons like two months ago. And I feel like it's been the past couple weeks that she's like really, really figured it out. Especially with us swimming more in the backyard since it's finally getting hot. She's been swimming a lot. She's like improving a lot with it and it's just been so great. We had such a fun time in the pool just now. I'm so glad we came in. We've been out here for like an hour and a half. We decided to just order on Postmates for dinner so that one of us didn't have to get out and cook and we could just really enjoy the family time. So Postmates is on its way from Urban Plates. Time for me to go dry off and we'll continue the rest of our evening inside. Okay, it is 8.30. I just put Grace to bed. I'm gonna hop on the Peloton, do a nice like 20 minute low impact ride to end my day. Well, kind of end my day. I'm gonna run upstairs to my office and just do something real quick, like 15 minutes of work. Rachel just sent me the second draft of the VidCon vlog. So I wanna get that scheduled for tomorrow morning. And I figured it's better to do that tonight since I've got sunrise swim tomorrow and then I'm gonna be with Grace. But all right, I need to stop talking because this is the most uncomfortable way to lean. <laughs> I don't know how I ended up so far on one side of the frame. I didn't think I set up the shot like that, but I'm definitely not getting off to fix it now. So I'll, I'll see you after. <laughs> The Peloton ride was good. I, I'm really glad I did that. I almost skipped it just cause you know, it was getting late, we went in the pool, but I'm really glad I still did it. It felt, felt really good. And hopefully that will help me sleep even better tonight because I, I'm definitely tired, which is fine because it's nine o'clock and I wanna be tired. I wanna go to bed. Um, I've, I've been in bed by 10 every night. That's been my goal and I've hit that, but um, I, <laughs> I've had varying levels of success at actually being able to fall asleep somewhat early. But I feel like tonight, I, at least in my brain, I'm gonna just like hit the pillow and fall right asleep. So it looks like the vlog just finished downloading. So I'm gonna do a quick kind of spot check review and then I'll get that uploaded for tomorrow morning. Um, when Rachel sends the first draft, which she did for this one a couple days ago, that's when I'll do like a really detailed watch back and send all my notes of like things I want changed or sections I want cut or text I want added or the little comedic punch-ins and zoom outs. And now it's spinning and there's text, woo. <laughs> all those things. Um, that's from the the first draft and now you know Rachel and I just like have such a, a good groove a good understanding that it is rare that we need a third draft for the vlogs usually on the the second one it's ready to go so I don't do like a full watch back of them anymore I just kind of like spot check it like any timestamps where I had noted like a big change or a big cut or an effect that I'm not sure how it's gonna land and I did have quite a few notes on this one um, the first draft was like 48 minutes and I know some of you probably would love a 48 minute vlog but I also know that there's a lot of people who don't so let's see with my cuts it is now 31 minutes so I'm gonna go through check this out oh I should download um the thumbnail Rachel sent on slack and then we'll be good to go so that is gonna be it for this vlog thank you so much for watching hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you next time bye